Welcome back, everyone. This is Super Stud Brother playing Legend of Zelda: The Wind Waker. We are here on Dragon Roost Island. We have received the con the uh, the Wind Waker, which is a baton, a conductor's baton that allows us to conduct music. Hey! I need to put it down with R. Let's see. What is this? Hold on. Hey. Yep. Damn it! I'm thinking what this means is that we, if we look up... Ah, I see, I see. Somehow we have to blow those bombs up, and I think I know how to do that. However, I think maybe we just better move on. Or maybe, let's see. Okay, around here should be somebody... He's not here, I guess. Oh well then. Got a bomb. Oh, we better toss him that direction. Let's see, not down here, but down here is just kind of a a an island of sorts. That I don't think we're gonna be uh, he's gonna be doing anything for us for a while. There appears to be markings that indicate specific directions. Yes, but we can't utilize it yet, so... I guess we'll just continue on. Alright then, let's see, where do we need to go? We need to go up, we need to blast rocks out of the way so that we can go up. What's this? Wind Shrine to the left. Mail Center, up. Mail? Let's see, now what do I need to do? I think I'm... Let's see, we come up here. I love this song. Whoa! Man, I need to stop doing that. Let's see, the bomb, what do I need to do with that bomb? Probably blow this rock up. So, we just grab the bomb, run up here with it, and toss! Oh, nuts. I think I just blew something sky high. Uh, let's try that again. Give me that! Up, 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 and away! There we go, got him! Alright, more sidling. I like the look of intense concentration on his face. Alright, we're just gonna settle along here. That's a long way down. Not as long way down as uh, some of the other drops, but we drop down here. Let's see. First, I want to see where it is that I'm planting this bomb. Okay, we should plant it with R. Back off just in case it goes. See, I don't think there's anything in the... I guess we can check the mailbox, see if there's anything. Good morning! Welcome to the Island Postal Service. What do you have for delivery? Nothing, I was just, uh, saying hello. Hello? <laughs> Link? Link, is that you? Yeah, you're, uh, the postman, right? It is! I'm pleased to see you're okay. I must say, you've traveled far for one with no wings. Well, that's what we've got sailboats for. And your sister? Is she... No, we're still trying to find her. Is that so? Well, don't worry too much. I'm sure she'll hang in there. I have an idea, Link. Would you like to meet our chieftain? Sure. I've told my people here about you, and all of us Rito are very concerned. I'm certain the Chieftain will befriend you and lend you the aid of our Airy. It's settled then. I'll fly on ahead and let everyone know you're coming. Come inside, Link. I'll be waiting. Alright, will do. You can fly, though. I have to walk all the way. Ugh. Sometimes it sucks to have legs instead of wings. But then again, it's 
much better than not having any legs at all. Uh, always looking to the bright side. Alright then. Besides, that didn't even take long. Well, have you discovered the cause of the Great Blue's anger? Ah, so you are a Link, are you? Quill has told me all about you. A troubling tale indeed. I insist that you let us know if there is anything we can do to help you. We shall do everything in our power to assist you. Well, thanks, Chieftain. That wasn't hard in befriending him. However, in the meantime, we have a problem of our own to deal with. Oh, that's... I'm sorry. When you arrived on the island, did you notice the raging dragon perched atop the mountain? Well, I didn't see him raging, but I did notice the dragon. As you can see, we of the Rito tribe are profoundly connected to the sky. We make our livings on the airways. We do so by the graces of the sky spirit, Baloo. When a Rito reaches adulthood, he or she journeys to the top of Dragon Roost to receive a skill from the Great Dragon. It is this skill that enables the Rito to grow his or her wings. Recently, however, the once gentle Valu has grown violent and unpredictable. Sadly, we can no longer approach him. If this continues, the fledglings who are of the of age will never be able to receive scales from Valu on Dragon Roost. They will remain wingless, and, in time, our very way of life will be threatened. As Chieftain of the Rito, my first responsibility is to solve this problem. My apologies, but I must ask you to wait for our assistance until this is done. Will you do so? No, I'm not gonna wait. I'll help! <laughs> okay, fine, we'll wait. Chieftain, what do you think of consulting Link with regards to your son, Prince Kamali? As you can see, Link is a gallant young lad. I feel certain that Prince Kamali would open his heart to him and speak freely of his fears and worries. That may be. Let me be direct. My son Kamali is of the age to earn his wings. Yet, he is weak in some ways, and in light of the current situation, he may just give up on ever getting them. What say you? Will you share some of your courage with my son? I didn't know courage could be shared, but sure. Will you meet with my son? Sure, why not? I thank you. We shall do our best to solve our problem as quickly as possible, so that we may better help you with yours. I have something I wish for you to give to my son. A young girl named Medley is holding it for me. Would you find her and take it? I am counting on you. Alright, now we need to go find... Here, Link, take this with you. Who knows, it might come in handy. We got a delivery bag! Finally crafted bags like this are used by Rito Postman everywhere. Oh, I feel so proud! With so many pockets, it can hold many items. Select it on the item screen and press Y, Z, or X to see what you have inside. You should find Medley in one of the upper rooms. Leave the Great Baloo to us. In the meanwhile, do your best to aid Prince Kamali. Will do. So, wow, that's a lot of boxes. What are all, what's all this? Eh, must be letters. That's a lot of letters. Okay, ooh. Mm. I wonder where this leads to. I believe this leads to Prince Kamali's room. Cozy. Ah, but I don't have anything for him yet. What am I doing? Wait a minute. What is that he's he's fumbling? What is that? Huh? Who are you supposed to be? Uh, Link? I'm supposed to give you something for, uh, from your dad, but I forgot it. I'm supposed to find Medley first. Hang on a moment. Alright. I guess we better find Medley first. But is it me, or was th did that ball look... Hmm. Special. Alright, let's see. I think we'll find her in... Yes, th that we will, that we will. Let's see, but if we were to come over here... 
Well now, I've not seen your young face before. Nope, don't believe so. Hmm? You wouldn't be here in response to our posting for some part-time help, would you? No? Sure, why not? Ooh, excellent, that's good. But first, to see if I can use you or not, I need to give you a little test. Just a small one. Match the seal on the envelope with the same icon on the shelf and throw the letter onto that shelf. Real easy, simple. Uh-huh. Use the control stick to select a shelf, and press A to throw a letter. Like I said, simple. Is that clear? Sure. Before time runs out, you have to sort at least ten letters. Give me your best shot. Okay, so... Oh, nuts! Oh, crap. Oh, I guess it... Ow! Flip! I'm be quicker about this. Okay. Sort of 15. 17 letters. 17 letters! Great! Good! Terrific! You pass! Okay, you get one rupee for every two letters, so that comes to a grand total of eight rupees, am I right? Yeah, 17. Come back anytime. I mean it. Anytime. The more letters you sort, the more you'll earn. Not a bad deal for both of us. I suppose not. Let's see, what's, what's back here? Ah, oh, I can't. I can't use my sword. I'm gonna break pots. <coughs> I'm sure these guys don't mind. But, let's see. Medley is in here. Hello. Wow, you really do have green clothes and a strange shaped hat. What did everybody else say about me? You're Link, aren't you? Oh, me? I'm an attendant to the great sky spirit, Baloo. My name's Medley. Well, to tell the truth, I'm not an attendant quite yet. I'm actually still studying to be one. Oh, what am I thinking? Here, this is from the chieftain. Link, he wants you to give this directly to Prince Kamali. Why didn't you give it to him? We accepted father's letter. It is a letter from a father addressed to his son. Since you've just received a fine delivery bag, why not use it to carry this letter down to Kamali? Well, we needed the delivery bag to carry it? When you want to take it out, choose your delivery bag on the item screen and set this letter to Y, Z, or X. The room way in the back on the first floor is Prince Kamali's room. You have to go down a couple ste steps to get there. When you meet Prince Kamali, please don't get offended by his manner. He has no bad intentions, I promise. By the way, um, listen, Link. I have a small favor I'd like to ask of you. Uh, nuts. Could you please come to the entrance of Dragon Roost Cavern later? I'll explain everything then. Sure, okay then. First, I'm going to go deliver this letter to uh, Prince Kamali. Whatever that was. Uh, oh yeah, here it is. Okay. Probably I'd better set it something. So, pull it out. Uh, let's see. Delivery bag. There we are. Alright. That's a lovely design he's got on the door. It's like a set of teeth. Probably just a diamond pattern, but it looks like a something with teeth. What do you want from me, huh? I I don't want to talk to anyone right now. Yeah, but Daddy wants to talk to you through a letter. A letter from my father? Yep. Oh, sure. Telling me to be brave is easy enough for him. It's not like he's the one who went through that horrible experience. It's not like he still has to get a skill from Baloo. Wait, you try to get a skill from Baloo? You're in this you're in this letter too, you know. Poking your nose in other people's business. You're nosy, aren't you? I didn't think I was, but Sorry, but I really don't feel like going to see Baloo right now. I mean, how am I supposed to get a skill from him when he's so upset? What? Are you trying to say that you can calm Baloo down? I never said anything like that, but sure. That's just a big fat lie. It's easy to say you can do anything. Bragging doesn't cost a thing. Point taken. I'll tell you what. If you can find me someone who can get past all the obstacles on Dragon Roost to get to Valu, then I'll listen to anything you say. 
All right. You're on, boy. But with that, this is Super Stud Brother. To be continued.